Go get him, Tiger. You mind if I call you Tiger? Yeah, it's kind of weird, I guess. Lock in. It's game time. Star-Spangled Banner. Welcome, everybody, to another presentation of the NBA Live on 2K Sports. Hi, folks. Brian Anderson here, alongside two fantastic analysts, Grant Hill and Brent Berry at the table, and our reporter, Allie LaForce. All right, let's check out the starting lineup for the Trailblazers. Inside, it's Grant and Nurkic. Simons and Thibel are the two wings, and it's Lillard in at the point. And for Los Angeles, Vanderbilt at power forward with Davis in the middle. Then it's D'Angelo Russell. Then there's LeBron James. And it's lights out in at the shooting guard position. Rivalry games, Grant, always extra spicy, especially when they feature teams from the same conference. Ooh, I like a little spice. But remember, only one team per conference gets to the final. So that's going to naturally develop some rivalries here and there. So tonight should be a really competitive game. Here's Simons. The Lakers getting their last shot to go. Here's lights out. That three's off the mark. And it's the Trailblazers ball. Fresh off a win against the Pacers. They were lights out from beyond the arc, and they spaced the floor beautifully in that one. Yep, made the defense work extremely hard and did a nice job of getting any advantage they could against the team that shot it well. And Russell's got the ball here for the Los Angeles Lakers. Lights out, the pass to Russell. No good on the three. Pass to Nurkic. Lillard with the ball. Here's Thibel. Out to Lillard. Let's go with a three. Rebounded by the Lakers. They want to keep rolling here, following the win against Brooklyn. And I think they were prepared to face pressure D. But that never materialized, so they took advantage. It took just a little bit of time, but once they figured out the D on that night, man, their offense was rolling. Lights out. That's good. The defensive effort was lacking a bit. But, hey, give them credit for finding a weakness there. Just really smart basketball and exploiting whatever holes that he's seeing right now in the defensive squad. Now here's Lillard. Coming off a 22-point game against Indiana. Yeah, but there's always this point you got to look at where did he also impact the game? It was on the rebounding end of the floor. A tremendous performance there. 
Here's Vanderbilt. To the paint. Outside for Russell. Three-pointer. From deep. And Vanderbilt hits from deep. And James, another dime that gets dropped. Someone that just loves involving his teammates. Portland has gone 0 for 3 from downtown. Timeout called. Portland, they're just giving away a run right now. The question is, can they stop the time? Well, hard to say right now. At this point, I've seen the coaches run through two or three iterations of defense. Is there a fourth? I'm not sure. It's the 2K leaderboard featuring this month's field goal percentage leaders. Anthony Davis on top. And, of course, LeBron James. Each of these two have been awesome offensively during the last month. Both great options from the floor. Yo, yo, pick up right. First quarter of ball, almost two and a half minutes in. Simons passes to Lillard. Simons outside, pass to Graham. Count it, one for one to start the game. Simon's playing unselfish. That's going to help this team get in a great rhythm. And Grant, this season, the Blazers adding a G League affiliate in North Portland. The NBA, I mean, the second to last team to do it. And the Suns next season will make it 30 for 30. Now there's a G League counterpart under each of the league's teams. And Nurkic throws it down. So much power behind those Nurkic dunks. Here's Lights Out. He's covered by Simons. Here's the pick. Davis, the pass to Russell. And it's Portland with a rebound. And we're approaching about three and a half minutes played in this first quarter. Simons outside. Simons, a screen on Russell. Lillard passes to Nurkic. Stolen by Vanderbilt. Fast break. Here come the Lakers. Russell, that's good. Well, understanding not only the routes, but the speed and angles of those routes, Russell with the knack to find the right spot. The three, here's Lillard. Rebound, Anthony Davis. The Lakers have gone five of nine from the floor. James with the ball, picked up by Grant. Davis drawing the double team, and here's Vanderbilt from the arc. That's in there. Davis with the assist. Vanderbilt's got six. And what's working here? Each guy is willing to make the next pass. Pass to Graham. Back to Lillard. 4-3. And he's now one for four after that one. And Lillard wasting no time getting three back. Lights out. The pass to Vanderbilt. Three shots. Three baskets. Great efficiency so far. And they've settled in quickly today. A nice flow and rhythm to their offense. Let's it fly from 18. And Lillard gets it to go. Lillard's got his second basket of the night. And Lillard came to the league in 2012. And the three-point revolution has agreed with him. But he can still hit mid-range shots, trust me. Now, here is James. A 26-point game for him in the win against Brooklyn. And let's not forget about the assist. His playmaking was critical for this team. Almost converts despite the contact. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from here for the Lakers. They've done a great job facilitating so far. So moving the rock and finding the open man, just great selfless basketball. Well, I want to add also the damage that has been done on the inside. It's a lot of rubble in there, but they're continuing to go right at the defense. Grant's shot is off. And even though he couldn't send the shot back at him, he certainly altered it. And again for three. And this is amazing. I mean, that moves him into fourth place alone on the list of most three-pointers in a season. It's been fantastic to witness. A year like this does not happen very often. Oh, the confidence he has. The confidence his coaches have in him. He's in the company of great shooters like Curry and Harden. Here's Lillard. Five points in the game. And I just love the energy they've showed on the defensive side of the ball, especially inside where they're putting up some major resistance. Davis. And Davis slams it home. Great effort from AD, just getting himself in the position and then grab the O rebound. 
And that replay courtesy of the AT&T 5G Slam Cam. And so it's Lillard who brings up the ball for the Trailblazers. Trailing by 13. Their last encounter was in Portland. Big loss in their last meeting with this team. Couldn't get anything to fall in that one. And there's a whistle. That's going to go on Jared Vanderbilt. That's his first foul of the game. Here's Lillard. And the dunk by Lillard. Yeah, every so often he's going to remind you that Dame Dollar can make you holler. James against Thibel. James passes to Davis. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Trailblazers. Portland has gone one for five from three-point range. A cold start. Here's Simons. Rebound, Anthony Davis. Time for some consideration in the passing category, maybe, Kevin. The shot is just not on. Get somebody else going. It's been that kind of quarter for him. The shot has just been unreliable. Now here's Lillard. Seven points in the game. Here's Grant. Drives to the hoop. Vanderbilt pulls it in. Vanderbilt's got his seventh rebound here tonight. And they've come out with a fearless approach on the boards. It's James on the wing. They set the pick. That one goes. Count it. James has got five points. And this defense needs to turn the screws and ramp up the intensity. They're looking a little loose out there right now. Russell against Lillard. From nine feet, Vanderbilt pulls it in. Vanderbilt's got eight rebounds in the game. Here's lights out. That falls. Nice assist by Russell. Give him eight points now. Well, the Trailblazers shooting just about 29% so far. Not great. Lillard outside. Takes the three and count it. Now four for nine. This is a one-man show right now. He's on a mission to get him out of this hole. Los Angeles has gone four of eight from outside in this first quarter. And he drives in outside for Davis. Tried to come right back with a three of his own, but it's no good. Bible passes to Lillard. Simons outside. Simons, a screen on Russell. Lillard fires away from way outside. Offensive rebound, Nurkic. Bible on the wing. Fires for three. Buries it from three. And Grant with a nice heads-up play, willing to make the next pass. And so it's the Lakers with it. Ten-point lead. And when you talk about Matisse Thibel, his defense obviously stands out. One of the more elite wing defenders in the league. But what else is Matisse going to give you? He's got to knock down open shots. If he does that and it becomes reliable, so will the minutes. And here are the Trailblazers now. The Lakers getting their last shot to go. Lights out. The pass to Vanderbilt. It's James on the wing, covered by Thibel. The fader, and the Lakers tack on two more. So far, they're owning both ends of the floor. We'll see if they can keep this going. Like tonight, that all the hustle plays have meant so much to this team. Now just sustain some of that energy and keep comfortable. Here's Grant, following the score by the Lakers. And here's Simons outside. Vanderbilt pulls it in. <laughs> the way they've gotten after rebounds has been impressive. It's stolen by Nurkic. Dybul against Davis. Outside Dybul. Pass to Lillard. The three is up. Russell with the rebound. Lillard's gone 4 of 11 tonight. The slam. Yeah, sometimes LeBron just likes to take it all out on the rim that time on display. Here's Simons. Really played well against Indiana in his last game. Tipped away. Stolen by Vanderbilt. James with the ball. Bible picks him up. Out to the right wing. And here's Vanderbilt from the arc. Lillard pulls down the board. Portland's shooting an unremarkable 30% in the first. And 
there's Simons. That one's good. On the assist by Lillard. And Simons doing a good job operating and getting to his spot in the mid-range. Here's Lights Out. He's covered by Simons. Pass to Davis. Shoots over Grant. And there's another one for the Lakers. His efficiency has been a big factor in helping them capture this lead. And it's Simons with the ball for the Trailblazers. It's a 16-point game. Now here's Nurkic. Checked by Davis. And there's a whistle. That's going to go on Jared Vanderbilt. Here's Lights Out, defended by Lillard. James, that's good. James has got 18 points in the game. And it looks like a change in LeBron's demeanor out there. He's going in the scoring mode. On the court right now for the Trailblazers. Thibel and Grant are at the forward spots. Damian Lillard out there with Kelly Oubre. And it's Nurkic in at the five. Now here's Oubre. He picked up 12 points in their last win against Indiana. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Nurkic. Hey, guys, lights out in their last game against the Nets. Put on a show. He had 57 points, and once again, he was lights out from distance. A reminder of the amazing things that he's capable of on any given night. It'll be hard to match that tonight, but he'll try. Guys? All right, Allie, thanks for the update. It'll be interesting to see if he can heat up once again tonight, Grant. Yeah, you know he wants to do exactly this, B.A. Just needs to continue to play with the same fire and energy. And you want to see him make sure that the teammates are also involved in what they're doing, especially if he draws that much attention. Yeah, this story in the second quarter, much different than the one in the first. We're finally seeing some aggression. Lights out. That falls. Nice feed that time from James. James has got assist number five here tonight. For Portland, they've gotten five of their first 11 shots to fall here in the second quarter. Lillard passes to Graham. Outside Oubre. Grant outside. Six to shoot. Over Vanderbilt. Grant's shot is off. Oh, can't punish the defense for leaving him open that time. That's a frustrating miss for a really steady jump shooter. Vanderbilt, the pass to lights out. And the officials will call the illegal screen here. Over the past month, here's the best in free throw shooting. Fifth is Damian Lillard. And over this stretch, his foul shooting has been exceptional. You could tell he was enjoying every single trip to the line. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. With some arc, and it's rejected. Out of bounds. It'll be Portland's ball. Unforced turnovers. They'll drive your coach insane. Reeves is checked in for the Lakers. And the Trailblazers making a change here as well. Simon's checked in. Oubre passes to Nurkic. Excellent D there from Davis. Well, a lot of players in the league are going to make that shot. And for him, it's pretty much automatic. It's a good defensive effort to prevent the layup. And that shot was going nowhere thanks to that aggressive swat. Yeah, obviously he had the shot well anticipated, able to shut it down with authority. Portland has gone 0 for 3 from deep to begin the second. Simons passes to Nurkic. Pass to Graham. Russell against Oubre. Shot clock at six. Nurkic a screen on Russell. And here's Oubre from the arc. Rebound, the Lakers. Vanderbilt's got 12 rebounds here tonight. Big time effort. And Davis slams it home. Well, size and strength and then the length of AD getting up to jam it. Any hope of coming back to win this game looks near impossible. I know. The way things have gone so far, hard to imagine. Now here's Simons. 
giving them some good production, putting up just around 16 and a half points a game. How about that shot? Not exactly something drawn up by the coaching staff. Here's Davis. And a great vision by Davis showing off those point guard skills from back in high school. And it's the Blazers with the ball. Timeout called. Portland. Well, we normally don't pick favorites, but come on. Do you have a player you like watching the most, Grant? All right, B.A., you're going to get me in trouble, but I do love Ja Morant. I mean, he flies. He plays so fearless. And he also gets his teammates involved. Ja is really fun to watch. And here's Grant from the arc. Rebounded by the Lakers. This feels like it's snowballed a little bit on them. The more he tries to shoot his way out of this slump, the worse it seems to get. They need him to get it together. Here's lights out. Again, the Lakers score. And he's going to nail these if you give him the space. That's just soft deep. The defense also looking defeated. The lack of hustle is driving the coaching staff a little bit batty right now. And it's Simons missing. You have to credit their effort. I mean, they've done an amazing job on the glass. Lights out. That's good. And now he's dropped two three-pointers in each quarter. And it's Simons with the ball for the Portland Trailblazers. At the conclusion of this one, they're off to Oklahoma City where they'll face the Thunder. It'll be their second game of a four-game road trip. Nurkic finds Oubre. Here's Thibel. Six on the shot clock. Will it go? And it's Simons missing. That's a shocker there. Did not expect him to miss from that range. He's got to be shooting close to 60% from there. Lights out. The pass to Russell. No good from outside. And we haven't seen them pound the ball inside and draw as much contact this quarter. Simons with it. Russell covering. And the basket is good. Simons has got six. Finding a way through. Contact comes Simons' way, and he just avoids it. On the wing, Davis. And give him another one. He's six of eight and looking solid. He drops yet another dime. Just facilitating this offense like a maestro. The floater. And Simons with the lay-in. Simons has got six in the quarter. Well, Simons developing this kind of deception to get to that float game. Man, that'll take him to another level. From deep three-point range. Sinks it. What range from downtown. This quarter belongs to him, and that's how you do it when you're out in front. Don't play it safe. Keep that momentum going. Fires the three. Sends it home from three-point land. 11 points in the game. They gave up a three at the other end. That's Simon's response. Here's lights out. He's covered by Simon's. Pass to Russell. It's stolen by Oubre. 34 seconds left in the first half. Now Graham. Back to Oubre. Now here's Grant. Beyond the arc. And Reeves pulls it down. They've shown the power inside. Their rebounding effort has been sensational. Davis hits. And you like the poise there from AD. He gets into some traffic. Doesn't speed himself up. And ends up scoring. Simons outside. And the shot's good. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. What if it goes? That misses. Would have counted had it gone. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers. Up 25 big ones as we head into the next period. Their efficiency has been off the charts. They're running their sets well with patience and purpose. We'll be right back after this word. And we welcome you to halftime. First order of business, time to take stock of the all-star voting. We keep getting closer to seeing how these all-star rosters will shape up. These guys are working hard to earn those votes from the fans. Yeah, these guys are so competitive every way. Anything and everything can be a point of pride. 
And back to the matchup at hand. Everything has been going smoothly for the Los Angeles Lakers. They're extremely active. I mean, relentless on the boards, getting a lot of 50-50 balls. Great work ethic. A sensational start for them. Lots of positive momentum heading into the second half. Glad you could join us. Ryan Anderson and crew are ready to take it away for the start of the third quarter. And as we dive into the second half, we'll find out if the next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it's been a runaway. LeBron and Vanderbilt are the three and four. Then there's Davis. Then it's D'Angelo Russell. And it's lights out in at the two. So that's who Darvin Ham starts the second half with. The shot by Lillard. No good. And for the Lakers, they're shooting very well. 62% and going right at the defense. Lights out. The pass to James. Vanderbilt, a screen on Thibel. Clock at six. And Vanderbilt slams it in. Great game for him. Double-double now. Just great offense. The screen freeing him up for the slam. Hey, without that screen, he doesn't get a clean look at the rim. Yeah, well, he settled for the layup when you can attack the rim and rise up like that. Lights out. No good. Russell against Lillard. Pass to Simons. Three-pointer. Portland again missing. You talked about things at halftime, and then you come out and you go 0 for 3. I'm sure that wasn't up on the board. They get it back. Here's lights out. He's covered by Simons. For 3, James hits the trifecta. James has got 21 points in the game. Over his long career, James has worked on his three-point shot. Kudos to the king. Lillard outside, looking to get back on track. Vanderbilt pulls it in. I mean, he's trying to shoot his way out of what's becoming a prolonged cold streak. Yeah, he's got to move on, forget about this sequence here, and, and try to find a way to get on the board. Now, here is James. 21 points in the game. Pass to Davis. And that's out of bounds. The Lakers will retain possession. As always, things getting interesting in the West. A look at the standings. Taking a look at the Lakers, they've been outstanding thus far, claiming the top spot in their conference. And of course, Portland, far behind in the standings. When I look at the Lakers, I really think the high expectations put a certain amount of pressure on these guys. But to their credit, they have really stepped up to it. I think every great team welcomes the challenge of trying to be elite, and they want to do it on a nightly basis. Now, here is James. A reliable go-to guy for them. He's averaging around 26 and a half a game. Plays like that show you the strength of LeBron. Could have been called for a foul, but LeBron still finishes through the contact. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. Well, the incredible athleticism of Scoot Henderson has drawn comparison to players like Westbrook, Wall, and Rose. Scoot said, quote, no, I don't want to try to follow up anybody. I want to have my own career where people compare to me. But those are some great players, some great guards and leaders. But I just want to make my own path. B.A.? Yeah, and that's where you have to be mentally. Thanks, Allie. From 12 feet to the left side wing. Russell from outside. The shot's good on the assist by James. James has got assist number seven tonight. And it's Simons with the ball for the Portland Trailblazers. Grant, the pass to Lillard. Puts up a deep three. And again, it's the Trailblazers from deep. 
looking to find the rhythm he had in the first half. That's now his fourth three-pointer of the game. And the growth of Jeremy Grant since he came into the league, Brent. It's pretty remarkable. Pretty good for a former second-round pick, an athletic guy that fell under the title of a, a project player, but in Detroit took a larger role on, and I think being able to produce at that level B.A. has given him the confidence to continue to grow in this game. Here's lights out. Pass to Russell. James with the ball. Vanderbilt, a screen on Thibel. James passes to Vanderbilt. Here's lights out. Clock at four. He takes it in. Thibel with the board. Thibel's got four rebounds now. To the middle. Here's Nurkic. And no good trying to use the glass. Los Angeles has gotten two of four threes to fall here in this third quarter. Russell, that's good. Well, the team gets Russell set up beautifully that time. Totally poised and no hesitation on that two. And here's Simons outside. Rebound, Anthony Davis. Davis has got a rebound number 12 here already in the game. Lights out, no good. He's so good at getting to the rim. Maybe tries to get a little bit too cute with that one. I thought he'd lay it straight up and in. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. Knocks down the triple. Lillard's got 19 points. <laughs> Just incredible. I mean, he's really making it rain out there. Knocking them down one after another. Kind of like he's in his living room right now. He's found a comfort zone. Once he gets that, the defense knows they're in trouble. Portland has gone three of seven from deep so far in the third quarter. Lillard passes to Graham. For three. Rebound, the Lakers. Vanderbilt's got rebound number 17, if you can believe that. No one covering. He's got 24. This has been a running theme for him. Hit a number of threes in the first half. Now nails another. Lillard against Russell. Lillard passes to Simons. The three. Rebounded by the Lakers. He just keeps firing from distance. I know he's trying to heat up, but at what cost? Back to James. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Look, with the size and athleticism of LeBron James, he gives you more problems than a math book. Grant outside. Nurkic high post. Vanderbilt against Grant. Thibel a screen on Vanderbilt. And here's Grant from the arc. LeBron with the rebound. And that's another just bad decision on a night full of those. His shot selection tonight has been questionable at best. Down low. Nice dish and the layup goes down. Lights out's got 26. They're winning the battle down low by imposing their will. Here's Simons. 16 points for him. Yo, watch it. Outside Thibel. A shot to stop the run. And they recover it. Simons passes to Graham. No good with the triple. The other team just looks more in sync and is riding the momentum. Well, the other team is scorching hot, and they come down on this end and can't find a way to get the Embers going. They've been very well-rounded and extremely focused. Coaching staff probably most proud of the effort of this team on both ends of the floor here tonight. And Portland's shooting only 33%. Not exactly consistent offense. Grant the screen. Lillard deciding where to go with it. Pass to Thibel. Five to shoot. And here's Grant. He drains it as the shot clock ticks down. Well, when he gets into the paint, he starts to get hungry. He goes right through the defense. He's a straight line guy. Here's lights out. Outside Vanderbilt from downtown. Lights out. The second chance points on the tip in. Lights out's got seven points here in the quarter. 
great anticipation off the missed shot. Oh, his timing was impeccable. And so Lillard will bring it up for Portland. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. And here's Grant from the arc. Yes, great play by Lillard to set it up. Lillard's got four assists in the game. Pass to Davis. Shoots it from the corner. And another dime for him. That makes 15 assists. He has been one step ahead of the defense all game long. Simons with it. Fires from deep. And Nurkic with the three. Nurkic has gotten his second bucket. Now trying more and more to utilize the three-pointer. It's a good idea. That's his second three of the game. One in each half. He's been a piece of the puzzle tonight, but it's a team effort. Everyone's contributing to this lead. Here's Lillard. He's got 19. This one for three. Rebound, the Lakers. Davis has got 13 rebounds in the game. Glass eating. It wouldn't surprise me to see him find his touch and still be a factor. Don't count them out yet. Now here's Simons. He's got 16. Lillard passes to Nurkic. Now Lillard. Inside. And Nurkic throws it down. Nice find by Lillard. He deserves some recognition for that kind of passing. The Lakers call timeout. And the Lakers going with a whole new group out there. Here's Lights Out, defended by Lillard. Lights Out, that's good. Now you have to extend that defense. I mean, you really have to stay connected to him at all times. Yeah, I'm not sure what the defense collectively was thinking there. You got to know where he is at all times. On the court right now for the Trailblazers. Simons and Theibel are the two wings. Inside, it's Grant and Nurkic. And it's Lillard in at the one. Here's Simons. Prince grabs the miss. Just not sure if he ran out of energy at halftime or what, but uh, so far just not himself in the second half. Out to the right wing. Here's Lights Out, defended by Lillard. Lights Out, no good. Portland has gone one for five shooting from the arc here in the fourth. There's the triple. Prince grabs the miss. And he just hasn't been able to get it going this period. No, I haven't seen him in, in comfortable spots or at least spots we've seen in this offensive set that are allowing him to settle in. Deep into the game, you rely on players like him to keep delivering. Simons passes to Nurkic. Ooh, coming through again, shooting five for seven now. Disappointing as a player to have such a great game and still be trailing. Not over yet, though. Out to Wood. There's the three. And again, another assist. That's another dime from him. He's tallying them up fast, B.A. Well, the Trailblazers shooting only 29% since the fourth quarter began. For three, here's Lillard. Goes back up. And they're going to count that bucket, and they'll send him to the line. It could be a three-point play. Not sure which clips they watched at halftime, but he has figured out how to attack the D, and they kept him in check in the first half. He's flipped it. Reddish has checked in for Los Angeles. <laughs> They've been playing with much greater physicality this half. Getting themselves to the free throw line is a bust. Since half, there's been a stark contrast between these teams. I'm talking about efficiency at the offensive end. Yeah, this team did something in halftime, going from a mild-mannered, half-court executing team to some heroic shooting in the second half. Now here's Simons. And players now able to get richer extensions up to 140% of their existing salary. 
But Brent, what was the impetus for that change? I think in certain cases before, it just didn't make financial sense for players to extend. But if the teams have the ability to go that high above BA and other teams can't offer you that money, you're in that position, you've got to take extensions rather than look for something that's greener pastures. And I think that's going to help teams to retain the players that they value, the players that they've drafted, and the players that they foundationally want to keep to build around. And here are the Trailblazers now. After the Lakers picking up a basket just moments ago. Portland, no good that time either. It's been a struggle all night long from deep, but doesn't seem like he's lost his confidence. He's still letting them rip. Their offense has been unstoppable, just firing on all cylinders. I mean, this team is just dangerous. Right now, every shot that they're putting up feels like it's going in. Now here's Grant. Nurkic up top. Can they get it? It's hauled in by Reddish. Well, he finds some space in that in-between gap there. Too bad he can't release that one on target. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. All right, guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for the Lakers. The way they've been chasing after their shots in this game is really admirable. Giving them lots of second chance looks at the basket, too. And I feel like another part of tonight's game has been the hustle. The hustle points, getting up and down, getting second chances, getting transition opportunities. They've been fantastic in that area. Now here's Simons. Pass to Lillard. Back to Simons. Out to Lillard from behind the arc. Wood grabs the board. Wood's got seven rebounds in the game. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. Damian Lillard picks one up. And for the players coming into the league, potentially set for life. But there are pitfalls you have to look out for, Grant. It's so true, B.A. I mean, it's tough. You can't take all your childhood friends along for the ride with you. You've got to be cautious with new acquaintances, so it'll definitely keep you on your toes. You must make great decisions. Now here's Lillard. Rebounded by the Lakers. Here's Lights Out. Hachimura outside. Outside Reddish. There's a screen. Wood inside. Working on Grant. And Wood with the stuff. And dominant play from Wood on the glass. Keeping the ball out of enemy hands and getting his shot. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Pass to Nurkic. Lillard with the ball. To win the cold spell. Gets the three ball to go. Lillard's got ten points now. Just in this quarter. And not just a volume shooter. Lillard very accurate the three and the Lakers hit again from deep this has been their game plan here in the final period we'll see if it continues to work out it's one thing to have teams shoot a bunch of threes but with this team being that hot defensively you gotta chase them away from anywhere near that line here's Nurkic and the bucket counts and he is on his way to the line he'll try to make it a three-point play And you think about Nurkic, 7 foot, 300 pounds, and when he gets around the rim, who's going to move him off that spot? And let's face it, this one was never really in question. They came out with purpose and just overwhelmed the opposition. A great win for the Lakers. And the disparity in the talent was obvious by the end. Sometimes you just don't have enough ammunition to compete. Yeah, B.A., just a total beatdown. And the next time these teams meet, <laughs> I can't imagine it'll be any different. And this result tonight, it gets them to 44 wins on the year. And they've had no trouble finding the win against this squad. They'll wrap up the season series with a clean 3-0 sweep. And when you look at the game, the one thing that helped fuel this team to victory was the efficiency for lights out. Just knows how to fill it up, and that's exactly what he did tonight. Nobody that they assigned to him could really get a handle on him. And he drops the first. Good on both. 
41 seconds left in the final quarter. And there is a whistle. That goes on Damian Lillard. That's it for him. He's fouled out of the game. If he hadn't fouled out, they may have pulled him anyway. This game is over. With the depth they have at that spot, they're more equipped than most teams to handle that kind of loss. Here's Lights Out. Launches a three. Sinks the tray. Lights Out's got 54 points. Showing us that killer instinct right now. No letting the foot off the gas for them. Yeah, up until that point, a competitive game, but once they broke through that barrier, it was all them. Complete control. Now here's Oubre. Woods over to help. And here's Grant from the arc. Knocks it down from distance. Like seeing Grant knocking down threes, especially when it comes in the form of getting revenge. Here's Lights Out. Jacks up a three. Misses the shot. So we see the Lakers taking the W here. They didn't have too many problems tonight. They didn't. Just a tremendous team effort. Once they had that big lead, they were not going to let the visitors back into the game. And that about wraps it up. For Brent Barry, Grant Hill, and Ali LaForce, this is Brian Anderson. Nice Thank work, you for guys. watching this 2K Sports presentation of the NBA. We'll see you later.